Hi there, hope you're doing fine today. We just finished installing our new radio that has an included rear camera. It was sent from the right side of life, so thank you very much for sending us this radio to test it out. Uh, yes, we received it for free like this, you know, but we still gonna make a complete and full review of it, of it an honest review. <laughs> Don't worry about that. So uh, here's a few images of this new radio. So here's the design of this radio. I think it's quite good. It doesn't stick out of the dashboard and goes quite well with uh, all the dashboard. The lighting here changes color and you can just choose one if you want, which is quite nice. Next here we have a USB key with our music on it, but you can also uh, have photos or even a movie to watch on this small screen if you want. Here there's a USB charger socket so you can just plug and recharge your phone. Here an auxiliary jack and here you have a little space for an SD card. One point I'm not too sure about and I'll have to ask the shop the right side of life. Uh, we noticed that the radio band, FM radio band, is the only one that is available for this radio. And in Switzerland, FM radio band is going to disappear soon and will be replaced by DAB+. I'm not sure about the name, if it's the name in English. Um, so if it's the case that this radio is only FM radio band, we won't be able to uh, listen to the radio anymore. Next, the radio is also Bluetooth, so you can connect your phone. That's much. Merci. <laughs> so you can either listen to the music you have on your phone. Can you put it this loud? Thank you. And <laughs> you can also have your phone calls directly on this radio and just be hand-free to speak while driving, which is a good option. Allô? Allô, maman? Tu m'entends? Oui. On parle dans la voiture, enfin, c'est sur haut-parleur. Sur les haut-parleurs de la voiture. Sérieux? Ouais. <laughs> <laughs> What's also cool is that you get a rear camera, but of course, you do have to make the install, so it's not that easy. But we watched. Uh, Boris the Defender's uh, YouTube video who also made the installation of this radio and we thought he had a good idea which is to connect the rear camera to the rear lights with his switch so we did the same I'll put the link of his video in the description below like this you can have a look we already had almost everything ready for this rear camera uh, to be connected to the rear lights because in fact here in Switzerland uh, the MOT asked that if you have some lights at the back they have to come on when uh, you put the rear gear to go backwards and uh, we did this connection and had to add a switch at the back so now we have two possibilities is either to put on the rear camera with uh, only the light switch but of course every time you want the rear camera on uh, the screen here in front you will have your backlights on and the second option is that if we put on the switch that we have at the back uh, when we put the rear gear to go backwards, everything goes on the camera and the rear lights. We already have a rear camera connected to our GPS screen, but the view is clearly different. So we can see our spare wheel from the up. Uh, like this, we can see and have a closer look at the rear of the vehicle. And now our new camera gives a larger and more general view of what's behind and there are some uh, lines here on both sides like this you can have a better impression of where where you're going there we are behind so i hope you can hear me well because there's so much wind today so we connected uh, the new camera just on top of the first camera that we have on on this first camera there's a 
metallic uh, sun, sunscreen I want to call it and we fixed the new camera on it we did the install like this because we didn't really know where to put it it's not absolutely well centered but for us it was the best solution we didn't want to to drill another hole in the defender so we find we found the best way to do it for us so all in all we think it's a really good product and it's a real revolution for us i forgot to talk to you about this remote control this is a really great upgrade for us we have the children at the back when we're traveling or going out on the weekends with the car and they are always asking us can you change this song can you put this one can you do this can you do that with the music and now they can do it by themselves from the back of the car so this is a really really good point when we installed the radio we did notice that some of the components could be better manufactured but we installed it we loved uh, all the features of this new radio uh, it's a real upgrade for us the rear camera seems to work well we will have to test it over time i do hope it lasts over time we're testing the camera by night, it's raining a lot, but we can see quite well on the screen. We can see the indicator lines on the sides. There's a few drops on the camera, but it's fine. As we tested everything uh, by day and by night, now there's a point I want to add is concerning the screen. If you're not right in front of it, you can't really see it properly because you can't move the screen, it stays in place. Uh, you can um, go in the settings and change the contrast and brightness and this helps a little bit. And last, if you are like us and didn't have any more lights here on the dashboard, there's also how we did it uh, when we installed the radio, we replaced the lights. So if you watch the video until the end, you will also know how to replace these small lights. Thank you very much to the Right Side of Life for sending it us for free. Uh, so this was our honest review on this particular product. We did the installation and now you can watch how we did this installation. I'll see you next week. Bye.
tu n'es pas un nouveau journaliste. Je ne suis pas euh, Madame Météo. <rire> pas besoin d'aller dans une tempête. Ok, merci. C'est bon, merci. En tout cas, moi, je t'entends bien mieux qu'avec ton... Quand tu as tes écoutes là. Je peux rentrer maintenant much wind <laughs> so we were testing the sound I'm not sure if you can hear me now why is there so much wind today 